guys, welcome back to Brunette Confessions. Marialis, what do you have for today? Hey girls, I have a difficult question today and I need your help. So I dated my ex for about five and a half years and there was a point in our relationship where his family couldn't afford a phone. So my dad put him in our plan and got him a phone. Now, a day is a phone is a lease. We broke up nine months ago and until this day my dad is paying for his phone and we have to we have tried to get in contact with him to give us the phone because he owes us $150. Unless we give unless we give the phone back and he has blocked my whole family and friends from his phone. I wanted to have com have compassion because I did end things with him. I know where he works. Should I just grow a pair and go get the phone? P.S. He got a new girlfriend ASAP. I'm over him, but I'm upset my dad is paying for his phone and he hasn't once asked to pay for it when he works. Please let me know what you think. Girl, you better show up and get that phone back. Yep. <laughs> you're Honestly, crazy. you're wild. No, it, it it stuff like that could happen. Like you date someone and then when you break up with them, they show you who they really are and they completely block you off their life. And yeah, you know, you try to help. you when you're in a relationship, it's yeah, like you don't think you they're gonna to do that to them. you. Yeah. But definitely stop paying for that. If you need to get the phone, find a peer wherever you have to peer, go to his house, knock on the door, get that phone back. It's only $150, right? Yeah. I just feel like... Or surprise him. <laughs> Pay it. If the phone will get cut off. And then one day he, you know, he's using his phone. He's like, what happened to my phone? You stop paying for it. And that's it. Yeah. Honestly, like, I feel like if you try, I, I would show up to where he lives. And if he's not there, then whatever. But it's so disrespectful. Especially that he has you guys blocked. Maybe he has you. He had you blocked before knowing that he had to pay for it. So I, I would say you could show up or you could just forget about it. So I would just say that was like your past. You know, I would just pay it off. It's one hundred and fifty dollars. Maybe it is like a huge debt, but just so you don't have to deal with that kind of person anymore. You know, you could try. You could try appear. Try to you no, know, <laughs> have him pay. But if not. Just Pay it and that's it. I mean, there's only one time you gotta pay 150 and then that's it. You don't have to pay his phone anymore. Yeah. So, so much stuff. Five years and he does that to you. It's yeah, but what can he do? People show their true colors when you're not with them anymore. And I would just say, you know, if I'll keep his car, <laughs> something pretty bad. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. Don't take my advice. Yeah, don't do that. Don't you go to jail. He'll know it was oh, you. Oh, for sure, for sure. So, yeah, if it's just like a little small step, like just cut that off your life then. Right. If that's the less like a string hanging on to him, like you mm -hmm. need to like just cut it off already. Mm -hmm. so and that's good you that you're over him. Life. I'm glad. Yeah, it's pretty good. It'd be way harder if you weren't. Mm hmm. So. Like, no, I feel bad. I'm gonna keep paying for his phone. Don't do that. No. I mean, sometimes some people don't deserve it. They don't deserve your good intentions, goodwill. Mm -hmm. They don't. So when you realize that, you just gotta drift away from that. <laughs> Cut it. Yeah. Like in every video we say. <laughs> well, I hope this was helpful. Anyone else has something to say? Anything else? You Anyone else? Us? I'm the only person. Well, we have Brenda too. Brenda, <laughs> No, bye. <laughs> Hope this was helpful. If you guys have any other questions, leave it in the Ask category. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.